so just wanted to show real quickly um, some basis of what I've started making so this is going to be for a new game that is getting created so I'll just press play so you can see so we've got the player starting off here for now you move around you can look and he can also jump just just a single jump sprint needs to be set up still but that is what we have for now so if I just push I'll just show you real quickly if it's going to let me So I'm not sure why my mouse is disappearing, but I'll just show you. So these are actually collidable. And the reason for them being like this is so you can just have a bit of a play around. Of course you can get on top of the blocks as well. You can kick them around and everything. So this is going to be for a future update, of course. I'll just quickly control Z that back. As you can see, we, we got like an example sort of stepping stone part over here as well. And we have started putting together some just base blueprint stuff as well. So <coughs> this is the viewport. It's got the player all set. And then we have the construction script, which is currently empty, and our event graph. So with the event graph, we have input mapping, camera input, movement input, jump input. But I'll just close off this. So I think in, in one of these code snippets, there is some information that we will need so we have the animations for our arms all here so we don't need to worry about that we've got a character mesh and textures here as well just bring them up so I've started trying to implement some of the desert throne assets within this project as well so all small stepping stones but we have the base base movement and everything running through this as well so if I try to find I, I think it is <coughs> in one of these settings just got to remember which one So this is all real basic, but we have the base movement as well. Got all of this, and I'm not exactly sure where I've set the settings for this character. So it's not in here. means it must be somewhere within the base blueprint so we got the first person character pick up projectile game mode so projectiles all hit we have the base weapon system which we can refer to as well but we have all our input actions, our map, our first person arms. So let's have a big look at them. So it has its own idle animations as well. And let's hope 
We have the settings set somewhere, but I'm not exactly sure where I set them. But they are somewhere here. We've got these base blueprints as well that we can also use. But we can throw in the base content within here too and just go over all of the basic content. But for now, that's about it.